What is up guys, Zack Scott here, playing Paper Mario the Origami King. I want to thank you guys, of course, for a million views on that first episode. I really do appreciate it. We are now going to get out of here, uh, out of this temple thing. Uh, we are 100% complete with it. And uh, let's see how the outside has changed, because it should be quite sunny. No one brought their sunny glasses. <laughs> wow, the sun is back where it belongs. It's so bright, like we're in an actual desert. Indeed, indeed. Professor, what's the matter? What is the matter? I've got it. The sun was the key all along. Come, we must get to the sun altar right away. All right, good for you. Uh, let's, <laughs> he's figured it out. So, uh, let's just take a look really quick at the map before we move on because map-wise, we got Temple of Shrooms done, but you know, we still got a lot of stuff in the scorching sandpaper. Uh, not, not the east, not the far west, uh, but you know, we still got uh, scorching paper, sandpaper desert and miner to complete and then furthermore um, you know that the shroom city itself which I imagine has changed quite a lot since we were last there uh, <laughs> I do wonder how many snippets are still there right we already had everything full let's head out and about and see what today's episode is going to be about because um, we had a boss fight last time we set the streamer free we got to probably move to the next streamer at the same time uh, man I imagine I imagine that this is going to be a little bit different here, but I don't know for sure. Let's dig this up, please. All right, great. Great. All right, so let's go over to... Um... Oh, wow, these guys are here now. Interesting. Boom. There was something that popped up here last episode, but no one knew what it was. Uh, is this where? No, we're not going to Shroom City yet. Yet. But we will, eventually. I just don't know what else would be here, you know? Like, like there's stuff to do here, correct? Wait. Time out. Time out. Where are we? Yeah, there's a collectible treasure. Here. At Sandpaper. Okay, so. Here's, here's an idea. I know, I know, I know, I know that. Um, let me put on my collectible treasure locator, which I already have on, huh? Huh. Well, let's drive around and see if the bell rings. I don't know. I'm a little perplexed myself, honestly. The bell is not ringing. Oh, wait, we can go behind here. Oh, the bell's ringing. There we go. There we go, I bet this is it. Excellent. It's one of him, Professor Toad. All right, and so now we have 100% completed this area. Good on us. We are now going to go south and check out what that's all about. And then we'll probably end up going back to Shroom City. So yeah, I don't really know what today's episode is about other than that. So let's go south. Let's see what we got. Scorching Sandpaper Desert. Excuse me. <laughs> so yeah, this place looks so different now that it's yellow rather than those other colors, which, oh my gosh. Can I just hit this guy? How do I take this guy out? Oof, okay, you know what, let's fight. Let's fight, come on. Gotcha. Sticker's gone now. Oh, oh boy, oh boy, what's gonna happen, what's gonna happen, what's gonna happen? Are we to walk the entire way? No, we're, we, we are to hit this guy until he gives up. I'm gonna try to put myself between the car and him. Gone. Excellent. We are not to walk the entire way. But there is obviously stuff that we have to do here, so let's check it out. Oh yeah, this leads down. Just as I suspected. All right, look at this, you two. The altar has opened to, up to reveal some kind of entrance. This may contain what I have been seeking, proof of the Ancient Ones themselves. Yes, it all makes sense now. You performed the ceremony with the sun incense, but the sun itself was missing. Now that it has returned, the path inside has revealed itself. Oh, wait until they hear about this back at the university. I expect registration for my spring semester courses will be at an all-time high. 
I'm not sure what the professor is talking about, but I'm sure glad he's so happy. Oh well, it's all thanks to you two, of course. This may have remained sealed forever if you hadn't been able to return the sun to the sky. Now then, let's hurry inside. I'm certain we'll find even more to celebrate, perhaps even a solid lead on the legendary Capitan Teoid himself. All right, let's go in. Let's see what's up, because we don't know what's up. I don't know what's up. Interesting path, right? What is this place called, out of curiosity? This place is called, oh, we're still in, oh, we're still in Scorching Sacred Bridge, okay. I'll take it. I thought this is a whole new world. Hey guys, uh, is it absolutely freezing in here or just me? I thought we restored the sun, why is it so chilly in here? Ah, I can explain. Although we are in the desert, we have now descended below its surface where the sun's warming rays cannot reach us. Actually, the mere lack of sunlight cannot explain this degree of chill. I retract my explanation. <laughs> My word, what in the name of peer-reviewed study is that? Oh, wow. It's ice, a huge chunk. That's why it's so cold, Professor. I get it now. Look at this. The refrigeration technology on display is more sophisticated than I could have ever imagined. Mother of graduate students. There's something in here. Someone in here. Hmm. Judging by the distinctive red spots in that unmistakable cloak, could it be... It's Captain Teoid himself. He's really real. It's This is no mere clue. It's the real deal. I must excavate the site and save him immediately. I like that there's frozen beef. There is a treasure over here. Whoops. All right. He's doing his thing. I'll, I'll let him. Aha. Aha. Now that's obviously one thing to do. So there's a treasure. I wonder if it's the, the closed fridge has anything to do with it, you know? And again, uh, let me just take a peek, see if there's any path over here. No, no path. So, elemental power, of course. Fire will melt the ice, I hope. And we can watch this again, I don't mind. This is such a cool transformation. All right. There we go. And the meat's cooked as well. <laughs> All right. He's not moving. Oh, I hope he can be revived. Maybe he's just stiff from being frozen for so long, poor guy. Should I try heating him up with fire again? <laughs> that won't be necessary. Burn not paper with fire, lest ye yourself become singed. He's alive, and he speaks the same language as us, kind of. Allow me to introduce myself. I am indeed the toad known as Ode. Captain T. Ode, to be precise. I have survived the uh, interminable, inter interminable passage of eons here. Interminable? I don't know. Interminable passage of eons here in this Arctic prison. Now I am free. Captain T. Oed, of course, Mario, Olivia, I think he means Captain T. Oed. Alas, I can finally say I've met a real ancient one myself. Now then, down to serious academic business. There is a simple question that has plagued researchers and archeologists for time immemorial. Now, in this historic moment, I have the opportunity to go directly to the source. What an occasion. Oh, Captain, my Captain. We have studied the diet of the ancient space on artifacts and oral traditions in the region. But there's just one thing that is that has us completely stumped. How did you take your coffee? <laughs> what? Cream and three sugars. Three sugars, it's beyond my wildest imagination. What a breakthrough. You, you ancient ones have probably forgotten more about coffee than we will ever know. My work here is done. Wow, coffee with three sugars. You must really like sugar, how interesting. Oh, I guess it's not that interesting. Anyway, why do you seem so sad, Mr. Captain? Is it because you were frozen, or did something else happen to you? In this moment, I am, a, I am as a bird in a cage. I yearn to sail free at the helm of my merino underneath the great cresting waves. Did you say merino? Do you know about the super merino? That's so weird, how did you get to the, muse to the musee already? 
So my Merino rests in a musée, as you call it. Oh, museum, yeah. It, it, it is no place for her adventurous spirit. She yearns to break free. You have my thanks, strange one. I know what I must do. What is it? What is he gonna do? He's running away. Oh, okay, I wonder if he's headed to the musée. He sure seems to care about the Merino. It was hard for me to understand anything he was saying. I guess that's ancient language for you. <clears throat> Sorry to interrupt, but I haven't made an archeological discovery in over five minutes. I'm just kidding. A little academic humor. Oh, thank you both for all of your help. You've made my dream come true. No, we should be thanking you. You were such a big help in the desert, Professor. So, thank you. Now then, should we head for the purple streamer in the Great Sea? Maybe so. All the toads rescued in this area. There's also some cooked meat here. There's also a closed fridge. I wonder if that has anything to do with anything. There is a treasure nearby. Oh, I see it now. There's a block on top. Okay. Well, how do I get up there? I don't know what to do about this meat. I might have to come back and try to get on top of that, maybe? I don't know. I don't know about this meat, man. I bet it's over here. Yeah, I bet it's on top of there. I can see the block already. Like, I can tell that there's something on top of it, so... I'll probably come back to it, but we probably gotta leave and then come back again, like, before for it to regenerate, maybe? I don't know. We'll find out. I'll come back to it after, uh... After I do Shroom City, baby! If you look at the, um, the map, this place, we still got some blocks, some collectible treasures. I imagine they're related. Uh, so, let's put on... Well, we got on what we need. We got, uh... Let's head, we'll, we'll finish this up soon. The toad there. Oh, we already went in there. So, uh, let's, should I fight this one? I don't know. Let's go, let's go back to the, let's go to the city. The city would be a good place. I'm sure it's changed drastically. But I also imagine that uh, we should go back in there and, um, you know, unveil what needs to be unveiled. Shroom City coming up. And we'll see how it's changed with all, when all the toads are back. Toads, what's up? Looking for a scorching sandpaper far east? It's uh, farther east. Yeah, okay, we're good. Let me park my car. All right, and then, so what do we have left here to, to find in Shroom City? Toads, for example, non-bottomless holes, treasures, everything but blocks. So. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and put in the alert for toads since there's clearly a lot more toads. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Anyway, get out. All right, here we go. Shroom City, baby. Welcome to Shroom City, previously known as Sniff City. Previously known as Shroom City. And then, so what is up, my friends? Yeah, the Sniffits came in and pretty much took over, but to be honest, we weren't really doing much with this place anyway. All right, I guess I'll go into these places. I don't know. What's wrong, buddy? The snoring is actually a huge upgrade from my last roommate. So so it's funny, because they're still here. They didn't leave. Now they're cohabitating. I'll check over here. I don't know what to look for. You know, like, I don't know. There's obviously a lot of stuff. I don't hear, what's up? What's up, Toad? This guy was just here when I got back, so we live together now. <laughs> I can hear your voice on my side of the room again. <laughs> All right. At least now they're having fun, right? Seesawing is fun. Seesaw, okay. Where are more toads, though? That's the real conundrum. Oh, there's a whole section. A new shipment of accessories is on the way. Come back soon, bring coins. So, oh wow, I didn't even notice this area over here. 
but that's a lot of toads rescued suddenly. Ooh, it's almost recycling day. All right. Then let's get this going. What is this? non bottomless holds repairs. Another coffee shop. Let's go in and see what's what. I'll just wait here, okay? You don't have to come in. You don't have to enjoy coffee, even though you're the one who's so curious about the coffee of the ancient ones. Oh, wow. Hey, this guy again. I don't know the same guy. Shy oh my and hi hi hi, what it'll be, amigo. I'll take the sombrero blend. Here we go. Delicioso. Shy oh my, we're the singing cafe. We love to jam, so let's partay. Oh yeah, come on. Oh, here we go. What a jam. <laughs> they're not really singing, it's more like percussion they're doing with their mouth. They're almost like beatboxing. Well, I'm glad I could visit. All right, my health is back up to maximum. Oops. Do it again. Oh boy, I messed it up, didn't I? All right, see, so yeah, I wanted him to be happy. <laughs> I, messed up, I messed up their song by stopping him. That wasn't my intention. All right. So, glad to have found that, I suppose. So, more stuff's coming soon, he says. We'll see if we can find any more toads. What's up with you, my pal? Yeah, the snippets came in and pretty much, yeah, that's what he said. I guess I, I thought I was talking to this guy last time. Oh, oh yeah, I already talked to him too, okay. My bad. Save it, just in case. The sun is out and all the toads are back in Shroom City. Plus, like a hundred sniffets, I guess. <laughs> yeah, still the sniffets here. I don't know why I would mess with that right now. Now that it's bright, I can see the light. All right, these two are just hanging out. I heard that smart guy Toad with the fancy hat is staying at the hotel here. Ah, pardon me. <laughs> All right. Uh, you know, I don't really need to spend my money right now. I already spent my money here. Let's go next door, or, you know, see what else is here. So far, I don't know if I need to buy any more items. I think the, the items are being replenished quite nicely. All right, nothing here either, but this is the way that we can jump next door. I, I've already been here, but like I'm missing Toad, so it's like, I'm looking for him, you know? I have plenty of confetti. All right, and then uh, there's a sniff it. Let me look over here. I haven't looked over here lately. I heard that a bunch of toads went to a dance party in a crypt and had their faces punched out. How come I didn't get invited? <laughs> it's good to be back and to have my face back. Wow, <laughs> is it weird that I said that face part second? A little weird, dude. Don't worry about it. Uh, no more toad notification bells. Let me double check and make sure that I I have. Uh, yeah, I still need a few more toads. I need a collectible as well. We'll figure out what that collectible is. Do not worry. We'll find out where the toad is, too. Do not worry. Oh, this area is clear. That's interesting. Well, Shroom City is really bustling now. Wait, sorry, Sniff City. Wait, I, I got it. Shroom Sh City. <laughs> no need to split the difference. You might have already figured this out, but I, you can just walk right through that tent. Can you believe this merchant stall was vacant and filled with some really old lamps? I figured I'd take over the business and I owe it to you all for saving me back in the ruins. Here, take this. 
There we go. There's the last treasure. The lamp scam. Treasure. Well, it was good while it lasted, but now I'm out of lamps, so I guess I'll shut it down. <laughs> there is a toad nearby. Yeah, I haven't figured out how to get over there. Oh, I wonder if I can just jump, jump, jump. Oh, it looks like maybe... Yeah, there, there's the answer for you. I can jump over here. And there's a beetle toad. There we go, woo, got my freedom back. So I still need, I guess, another toad. Can't seem to get over there. Well, good thing I found that out, because uh, that was a necessity. Still looking for like another toad or two. And like I said, this is a 100% playthrough. So I'll be doing my best, well, okay. A toad near here. It was my idea to keep the lights on during the daytime. It's totally worth it, right? <laughs> Good idea. Uh, so, yeah, how do I get back? So there was clearly a toad. Here, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out, do not worry. Or maybe we won't, but I hope to. There's a toad nearby. Yeah, this is a bit perplexing because I don't know, I don't see a toad, but maybe my eyes just aren't doing very good right now. There's something funny about the grass around here, but I'm too sleepy to investigate. Do you think I have to dig it up, maybe? Here, dig right there. Yeah, this is odd, because I don't know. Oh, well, oh, that's a treasure. I thought he got all the treasure. Gold sniff is statue, so no. But I, I, don't, I'm not, I don't have the treasure. Now I got all the treasure, but that wasn't a treasure alert. That was a toad alert, right? Well, what, what alerts do I have on right now? Yeah, I, I have on toad alerts. Yeah, this is odd, I don't know. So I, I already found the, the thing in the grass. Oh boy. Well, here's here's the, here's the solution. We put on our, uh, we put on our toad uh, radar, I guess. And this is almost out of batteries. Oh, it's over here. Huh, it's up there now. This is odd. So I definitely, here, here's an idea. Oops, dang it, okay. Let me turn off that radar. There's something going on. This is a bit of a journey each time I miss that jump, so hope I don't miss it any more times. The, the light is shining on a mushroom, so... I mean, it looks like a mushroom cutout or something. So, we'll figure this out soon. There it is. There it is. There we go. Is everything just, like, flashing green and purple in front of your eyes, or is it just me? Oh, well, there we go. All the toads rescued so now let me guess we now have shroom city 100 percent complete as well so scorching sandpaper desert with the blocks and the treasure is all that's left um and so let's get that finished up i don't know i might have to travel uh out of here you know i might have to do that in order to finish it up but um we'll we'll do it we'll do it i'll, I'll just i'll load back in as soon as i uh as soon as i've done that all right guys, clearly I did not need to leave and come back because look at this, there's no way to have jumped up on those. So, 
There's gotta be another way to get on top of this box. Okay. <laughs> I, you know, I wish I would've tried that earlier. But whatever. There we go, and it's a treasure, and it's the item blocks, and there we go. We got, I, I assume all the collectibles, yeah. We have now 100% completed Scorching Sandpaper Desert. So, what we're gonna do is we're going to leave this area. We did it. I guess I'm gonna leave Professor Toad behind. Um, I'm gonna leave him behind, and we're gonna see what needs to happen here. But he's, uh, you know, he's, he's, uh, he's gonna be gone, right? Let's just save it, just for now. He's gonna be gone probably. He's not gonna come with me through the through the tunnel. There's no way for me to get here. How? Well, here's a question. Will he go with me if I go south? How did I get here? I don't remember how I got here. Let's go south. Excuse me. Let me look at the map really quick. Uh, yeah, Super Valley. So, I mean, I don't think he's gonna get on a boat with me. I don't think he's gonna go through Breezy Tunnel with me. But I'm curious what happens if I do try. Will he go that far south with me? I don't know. Let's find out. Oof. Excuse me. I'm. No, he won't. He won't do it. He's just gonna leave. So, with that said, um, let's not go this way. I'll just use the warp pipe to get back to the museum, and then we'll see if uh, if Captain Captain T Ode or whatever, whatever you want to say his name. Uh, is in that location. So we're gonna go up here, go through the warp pipe. This is like a totally open world Mario game. I mean, well, so is Odyssey. Well, I guess, was Odyssey totally open world? No, because you got to got to choose it from a map. So, well, I don't know how to describe it. Anyway, into the warp pipe. Sorry, Professor Toad, you cannot come. Well, you can, you, you're welcome to, but you're not gonna. So, uh, we're headed back to Toad Town to the Muse, whatever they, whatever Olivia called it. We're going back in here. But Bomb is dead. <laughs> I keep forgetting that. Where, where is he? I'm all right. We have some new pieces on display, but I thought he'd be here. Well, what the heck? I thought he would definitely be here. Where, where to now? I'm super confused. On what to actually do. Okay. Hold on, we got a notification. Visit the sensor lab on Picnic Road to try their latest gizmo. Okay, so Picnic Road, the hidden block unhider. Okay, yeah. Well, next time I get a chance, I don't even remember. Where's Picnic Road? It's over. It's all the way over there. There's got to be a warp to it, but probably the. Okay, I'll, I'll I'll go there soon. Eventually, eventually. I guess what we could do, uh, we could take the uh, the ship and head to the next one, right? The next one is uh, the Great Sea. I think that's where we're to go. I think. What does she say? Maybe the docks will lead us to the Great Sea. Yeah. Okay. Yep. So that's where we're gonna go. The Great Sea. Next time we get a chance to go by the sensor lab, I will. I don't remember how to get there quickly. Uh. So I know how to get there. I just don't know how to get there quickly. So um, I, I'm sure it's. I will actually. I'm pretty confident I how to get there actually now. Now that I know. Now, now that I think about it, I'm pretty certain how to get there. Maybe. No, I'm not. I'm not. Let's, we'll get there next time. The hidden block and hider. We'll get it. Don't worry. Trust me. It'll happen. Um. So, the Great Sea. Shall we set sail for the Great Set Motor? For the Great Sea is a motorboat. <laughs> oh, man. They, they got me. They got me. I almost said set sail. So, let's, uh, let's venture out and see what we can see at the Great Sea. All right, can we boot, we can boost it, just like the, uh, just like the car. What's up? Ah, oh, I dropped it, sploosh. A fat sack of precious coins right into the old drink. Okay. Oh, wow. Mario, look, the streamer dips into the sea. How are we supposed to follow it down there? 
dude, I don't know. I don't know what to do. Now, how big is this area? Because we haven't really searched this area. Like, we haven't really searched this area, you know what I mean? There are a few islands. And I think there are toads there, maybe. That was one thing that we were supposed to do, probably. Look at the fog. What happens if we try to go through the fog? Oh, dear. Whoa, a vast. Yeah, that's a no-go. Oh, wow. This fog is unbelievable. Can't see through it at all. We just get lost in that mess. Better turn back before we get ourselves in trouble. So, uh, what a pain in the port bow. Uh, wish we had a seas chart, then we could navigate through this haze. Say, speaking of sea charts, you two ever heard the legend of the legendary Captain Ode? Legends speak of a legendary toad who moved beneath the waves and owned a legendary sea chart. Ah, but those are just tall tales. Not much truth behind them, I reckon. If only they were true, a sea chart like that might help us cut right through this blasted fog. Do you mean Captain T. Ode? We know that guy. He said he'd be at the musee. Aha, you two jokers, that must be, that might be the most ridiculous fib I've ever heard. You met a legendary captain from ancient times and you're just hanging out at the dusty old museum. Ha, you, you're serious. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's head straight for the museum. Okay, I mean, I, I went there. Believe me, I went there. And I was hoping to find him too. But now I don't know. All right, let's head out. I don't know, man. Return to town, that's how you do it. Yes. Okay. The fog needs to dissipate before we can rescue those toads anyway, correct? Probably. I don't know. So. So what? Here we go. I wish I could run in this game. Back to the musee. Museum, whatever. So, uh. Nope, that's not it. Excuse me. Here it is. Alrighty. Huh, I thought Captain Teod would be here to greet us. Yeah, me too. Captain Teo, do you mean Captain Teoid? <laughs> he's he's not real, you know. It's all just an ancient legend, quite colorful to be sure, but imaginary. Boom, there he is. Hey, the sign says no piloting the Marino. You're in direct violation of the sign. Ah, my precious Marino, still beautiful, still formidable, and yet time marches on. Hey, we were just talking about you. So did you find the, uh, the thingy we, you, we, you were looking for? The seed chart, that's what it was called. Oh, I hope you have it. What I lost may never be found. All that remains is a shattered reflection like a teardrop in a pond. But yes, I have the seed chart. <laughs> I propose a trade. Convey me and my vessel to the great sea and you shall have my chart. Sorry, I'm late, but I think I heard everything a, wh a while I was running in. You want to get that rig to the great sea, I'm your toad. Oh, this is gonna be so cool. A submarine on a boat, you two famous captains? I can't wait. What about my exhibit? It's the star attraction. I can't curate something else out of thin air. Well, let's see. All right. Easy. Keep her coming. All righty. You should be good to go here. You decide you want to rig up a few more out, out boots? Give that vessel some real oomph. You call me. All right. You have my gratitude. And you may now have this. There we go, sea chart. Excellent. Yay, thank you so much. I can't wait to adventure on the sea. Who knows what kind of amazing things we'll see. Whoa, has anyone ever rhymed those two words before? <laughs> I must say, this whole situation with Captain Teoid being real uh, is what we in the museum business call completely bananas. That said, there is no disputing the ancient text. The Marino is yours, Captain. I wish you good luck on, and toad speed. <laughs> and if you should choose to return to my humble museum at any time in the future, I will gladly offer you a personal tour. Farewell. Well, this is going to be super. I'm just so excited that you all have called on me and my boat to help. 
And I can't wait to see what that submarine can do going under the water. <laughs> what will they think of next? Anyway, I'm ready when you are. All right. Indeed. So he's going to go. Is he? Where are we going? Where are we going? What's up? I want to talk to Captain T. Ode. A voyage of a thousand fathoms begins with the flooding of a single ballast tank. All right. <laughs> I don't know. If you say so. I don't know anything about that. Anyway, uh, what's up? Come here. Shall we set motor for the great sea? Indeed, we shall try at least. All right. The great sea. View the sea chart, yes. And there it is. The red boat marks your current position. Check my seat chart as you go to keep from getting lost. So, it's mostly blank right now, but I'll add new islands uh, we discover along the way. So what is that? Yes, that's what I was curious about. That, I've already mapped one island on the sea, menacing, skull-shaped. I named it Bonehead Island. All right. Bonehead Island is said to hide a secret tide to the fog surrounding the great sea. Let's start there. Okay. Oh, wow, we can dive. Set course for Bonehead Island. Make it thusly. So, what if we dive by... Just curious. He said that, you know, he dropped some coins here. What if we dive? What if we dive? Looks like there's something here. Shall we investigate further? Yes, indeed. Let's see what we find. Oh, wow. Oh, the great sea floor is so pretty. Wow. Okay. There's some treasure. Uh. How, okay. How do I? It's so imprecise. It's over there. It's like reverse. Here it is. What, let's return to the surface. Does that shy guy want that? I don't know. Is it mine now? Can I have it? It's pretty cool. Heavy bag. It's shy guy's press. Okay, okay, let's return the heavy bag. It's a bag. Looks like it belongs to someone. Better not peek. <laughs> Better not peek. <laughs> All right. Okay. So, I found it. All right, I dropped it. So, here we go. There it is for you. Gas, my wallet. You found it and you didn't keep it? Amazing. Please take this reward for being so trustworthy. Oh, okay, I wish I would have kept it. I'll never let this huge sack of coins out of my sight ever again. <laughs> I don't know about that. So, uh, let's go check out. Just curious what happens if we check out the ribbon. This is interesting to me, obviously. There's the ribbon. Hey, the streamer is stuck in the sand down there. We can't follow it like this. Okay, well, I just thought I would take a peek. Okay, yeah, Bonehead Island, here we come. I'm just curious what happens if we go this way. He said he would mark the islands on the map, I guess. We've been over here. There's another ribbon over there in the sea. Ah, so that's the vessel known as the Princess Peach. How subtle. All right, so that's actually pretty close. Wow, okay. That's, yeah, there's another streamer there. What happens if we deal with these fish? What, like what, is, is this a suspicious part of the, like since the fish are all here, like is this suspicious enough? Ah, Fortune smiles on us, okay. I don't know. There's, is this the same streamer? This is another streamer, right? I'm so confused. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. Well, let's head over to Bonehead Island. Hmm. 
This is gonna be an interesting thing. Oh, hey, there's a guy. This fog is incredible, huh? Can't move forward if you don't know which way you're going. I read the, that on a twist off cap once. That bottle of juice was so wise. So clever. Uh, so yeah, we just got, okay, this is fine. Don't worry, I'll just go this way. And the fog we can get through. Ah, fog! It's okay. Fear not, my seed chart so, shall guide us. We still got some time left. It's okay. I'll go up when it seems appropriate. Now it's time to go up. And there it is. Bonehead Island. Whoa, a creepy skull. All right, we're here. All right, Bonehead Island. Lots of little birds here. Oh, sure is creepy. Is it just me or is that big ugly skull face staring at us? Don't surrender to fear. You must explore this island. Secrets await, and I want to hear what they are. All right. Well, here we go. This place looks fairly small, I hope. There's a merchant, I think. Fun, funky, and functional. I have accessories for sale. Uh, yeah. Go timer plus. You better believe it. Give, give me all your accessories. And then, thank you, you're welcome. And then, coin step counter. Walk, okay, walk uh, 10,000 steps and you'll be rewarded. Okay, great. Yes. It was costly, but... Thank you. Okay, great. Let's equip the accessories. In a second. Hold on, I could be getting steps in right now. Hold on. Accessories. All right, so let's just go with this. This makes sense. And then more time. Map-wise, are there toads here? There are, this is good. I don't necessarily want to fight the birds, but I will if they, if they hassle me. If I can avoid them, I'll be happy to. Although, I could probably use the coins from winning battles against them. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. There we go. Blocks hit. Oh, we got all the blocks hit. Good. Good, good, good. Now, this is something interesting. What is this? This is a coffee shop or a sensor lab? Coffee shop. So, this is the second coffee shop I will have visited. I'm gonna get caffeinated. Let's see about it. Rattle, rattle, welcome, come on in. This one looks scary. Bone Dry Cafe, a morbid mocha. Here we go. I'll have the morbid mocha, please. What problem is, Mario? You know, like, spoon? What? <laughs> what? You wanna borrow mine? Coffee here, big tasty. Sir, please don't chew on our spoons. Other people need them. <laughs> All right, so it's, it's chill. Hey, is that the other, is the other dry bones okay? He's been collapsed for an hour. The coffee I made him must be ice cold by now. Hey, cut him a break, pal. Him up all night, prowling. He big, big exhausted. The night shift, that's rough. Let him rest. I'll pour him a fresh cup when he wakes. All right. I'm glad to have visited this coffee shop. Mmm, that dry roast smell. <laughs> dry bones like this is the dry roast. Makes sense. Well, uh, let's... Oh, that, that hole I actually jumped through. <laughs> All right. What? Okay, okay, good, 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 good. Crossbones. 
Huh. Don't know what to do there. Huh. I mean, you know, I don't know. I don't really, I mean, I have the fire of elemental. Oh, I wonder if I can start that campfire now. I wonder if I can set myself on fire. I don't know what to do. Huh. Oh, we're over here now. All right, you saved me as thanks. Let me show you where to find a sunken treasure. I'd claim it, but I'm lazy. Awesome, so he's gonna mark the map. Okay, great. This is awesome marking the map for the sunken treasure Thank you And we got all the toads rescued So bizarre Oh man, okay, we got to fight that's okay haven't fought today. I don't think Okay, uh, let's see. Yeah, this is easy. All right, great, great lineup it says. Now, flashy boots, probably, is that what it takes? Maybe so. Done. Ah, oh, they broke. What about... Let me go back to my gear because I have some more flashy boots we can bring in. Oh, but we're gonna bring it. We're gonna use a hammer. Let's use a flashy hammer. There we go. Great. Nice. I like that. That's good. Good deal. And a mushroom as a reward or something. Oh wow. Okay. Yeah, I think that lines up, right? Indeed. I just matched it mirrored to the other one, so that's good. Okie doke. Let's see what we got up here. There's a treasure. Just want to make sure there are no blocks. All right, we got a submarine Marino. Got a lot of treasures. Do we? Ha is this area complete? This is 100% complete. Okay, nice. This is a little bit easy, but nice. Nice. All right. What the heck is this? If you seek paradise, gather the three orbs on Diamond Island. Pair of dice? What in the world is this statue talking about? Oh, dear. Oh, my gosh. A giant fan. That's my biggest fan, guys. Nice. Blow away. Did it blow away all the fog? If so, that's awesome. There we go. <laughs> Excellent. We've done it. Wow, the fog totally vanished. That was amazing. Seek and ye, ye shall find. Come, follow me to paradise. Oh, that sounds like fun. But, well, I guess we need to deal with the purple streamer first. I guess so. So. We had fun here, right? I think so. We need like a save spot or something. Shall we ship out? I suppose so. Where to? So this there's no more fog, right? That's the that's the thing, there's no more fog. Well just save. So 
Yes, that awful fog is finally gone. Now we can explore the rest of this big old ocean. And there's a streamer. Aha, there's a streamer over there. Let's follow it, Mario. So we will follow it next episode. We did a lot today. Thanks for watching. We got another notification. What is it? A new engine for your boat has been completed and is now available at the Toad Town Dock. Okay, I guess I'll return to town and get the new engine because I would rather have the new engine than anything else. We will do that next episode. There's a big whale. What a what the heck? What the heck? Let's go. Should I see what this whale is all about first? This looks a little scary, but here we go. Can we can we dive? Dive on this whale. Wow, I don't know what to do. Can we get a look at this whale like from the front of it? Nothing here. What about if we go in front of it? That'll be something, right? Oh wait, he's... That was so weird. Anyway, it saved it, so we're good. We're good. Thanks for watching. Come back next time for more Paper Mario, the Origami King. Goodbye. I just returned to town. What is this? Welcome to Toad's Automo Boats. The latest boat engine we've got going is no joke. It's twice as fast, 10 times as fun, and a million times more dangerous. So, just how you like it, am I right? Now then, I can swap it out for your old motor for 5,000 coins. We got a deal, yes. All right. <laughs> Giddy up, that'll do her. Have fun out there and keep the dry side up. All right, so we got a new engine. Great, Mario, you've doubled the top speed of my vessel. I'm both excited and terrified of my newfound power. All right, well, that was it, guys. Thanks for watching. Come back next time for more. We'll venture out on the great sea once more next episode. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help the channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join on YouTube and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop. Come back next time for more.